Holy Spirit's filling people right now. Holy Spirit's f- If you feel the power of God on you right now, come up the front. The Holy Spirit's filling people. The Holy Spirit's filling people right now. Right now. Right now. If you feel the power of God on you, just fill the front here. Just keep moving. Keep moving either way. You feel the power of God on you. You feel the power of God on you. Can I have some catches? Feel the power of God on you. You feel the power of God on you. That's the glory of God. 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 Glory of God. Glory of God. Glory of God. It's come into the room. It's come into the room. The glory has come. The glory has come. It's the glory of God in the room. It's the glory of God in the room. God, the glory of God. That's the glory of God, the glory of God, the glory of God in the room, the glory of God. That is one thing more, and I, I feel I'm feeling. in the heavens champion I tell you the glory of God is in the room the glory of God is in the room
feel the power of God? What, is, what does that feel like? It's warm and peaceful. Warm and peaceful. Yes, we have. Yes. Praise God, praise God, praise God. Thank you, Jesus. God is a big God. <laughs> oh, oh, he's a big God. There's nothing that's impossible for him. Oh, he can bring breakthrough. Oh. <laughs> yes. I don't know. Oh, Father. Oh, Father. He will baptize his people in the Holy Spirit and with fire. People's lives are being changed right now as the Holy Spirit comes. As the Holy Spirit comes, people's lives are being changed. Reach out to Him. Open your heart to Him and He will come to you. Behold, I stand at the door and knock if anyone hears my voice and opens the door, I will come in to him, open the door to the Holy Spirit, the Spirit of Jesus, and he will come in and he will sup with you. <laughs> Just, I don't know. I don't know. I can't describe. You can't describe it. Hallelujah. I just, I think it's wonderful when the Holy Spirit makes a mess of the meeting. That's why we've come. Amen. Hey. That's why I've come. I'll tell you that right now. I don't know anyone else. Everyone, you're going to come for that. <laughs> We're hungry for God tonight, aren't we? Are we hungry for God, Mia? Absolutely. Absolutely. Hallelujah. You're getting more? Yes, amen. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Uh, what's happening? I can feel his presence. You can have some more. Have some more. Pra what's happening here? I love him very much. I love him very much. And I want much more souls to be saved. <laughs> Oh, I love him very much. Oh, thank you, Lord Jesus. Thank you. Thank you, Lord Jesus. You are much more than enough for me, Lord. You are much more than enough for me, Father. Thank you. Hallelujah. I was meant to be here now. Thank you, Lord Yeshua, my daddy. You are my heavenly daddy. I love you so much. Hallelujah. Oh, save many more people, Lord. My family, my friends, everyone, Father. Oh, empower us, Lord. Use us mightily for the harvest, Father. Thank you, Lord Yeshua. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Many more churches need to obey the Lord. To... Amen. Amen. Now, a hot spot has come into the meeting. A hot spot. A hot spot's where the glory of God comes into a location. So, if, if you're in ministry, you're worship leading, you're preaching, you have a desire in that way, uh, just form a line along here and you're going to go through the hot spot. If you're really hungry for God and you want to serve Him in that special way, then just form a line here. There's a hot spot right here. The glory of God's right here. Come on. There's a. Just keep moving out of the way. Just come through. Thank you, Jesus. Keep coming through. You feel that? 
Yeah, electricity. There's a hot spot here. Just keep moving through. There's a hot spot right here. Oh, you feel that? There's a hot spot here. You feel that, Joe? Hey? Amen. Right. Whoa. Awesome. Just move her off. Just move them off the floor. You've come into the hot spot, the glory. The glory is right here. Right here. Just move them off the floor, John. Here's a lightning rod. Thank you, Jesus. <laughs> oh, Lord, bless him in Jesus' name. Amen. Praise God. Let's get him off the floor. Oh, what are you shaking my hand for? like a fire. You feel that? Yes. Help her along. Here's another lightning rod. <laughs> Praise God. Oh, glory, 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 glory. You feel that? It's coming, she says. Praise God. That's the power of God. Just keep walking through. Just keep walking through. Can we get him off the floor? Keep walking through. We've come for the power of Jesus Christ. Is that right? We want to receive that impartation of His power to heal, to deliver, to preach, to prophesy, to evangelize. Amen. Just take it. Just take it. Just take it. There you go, sister. I love that song. I don't want another. I want Jesus. Baptize me in the Holy Spirit. Baptize me in fire. A lot of people want to be preachers and so on, haven't we? What do you want to do for Jesus? I want to be evangelist. Where? I've already done evangelist, but I want to have a prophecy. Prophecy. You want the gift of prophecy. Receive it. Amen. 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 What do you do in the kingdom? Oh, just do deliverance. Because I looked at you, and you're like dangerous in the kingdom. <laughs> There's joy. <laughs> Preach, prophesy, evangelize, everything. 
Everything. Praise God. Go for it. Hallelujah, sister. God loves you. Receive the love of God. She says, hello. 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 Hello to you. <laughs> getting drunk. You want to help me, Sarah? I'm getting drunk. <laughs> Oh, God. Oh, here is a good man. Here is a good man. Here is a good man. Praise the Lord. Here's another warrior. <laughs> And the Lord says, let's have fun tonight. Let us rejoice and be merry. Luke 15, the, the parable of the prodigal son. And the father said, let us rejoice and be merry and dance and make music. Lord, come on them, I pray. You feel that? Like a wave of, like a wind. You feel that? Yes, thank you, Jesus. Just tingling all through me at the moment. Beautiful, just beautiful. What do you think of Jesus? I love him so much. You love Jesus? I love him so much. You know, when we meet the Holy Spirit, we meet Jesus. You're meeting Jesus in his manifest power and glory. you Oh, that's the power of God. <laughs> so beautiful. Words can't explain. It's so beautiful. Just beautiful. His beauty is beyond description, isn't it? Amen. We're having fun tonight, Sarah. Amen. Praise God. Happy birthday, Rosa. <laughs> that's the glory on you, sir. Some people are just too quick to come out of the glory. <laughs> oh. Jesus has got him. We'll be praying for healing later, okay? We'll be praying for healing later. You've been like a prodigal in the past. Amen. I see sadness in your life past sadness that's the Holy Spirit on you yeah you know it's a wonderful thing to meet a prodigal to meet a prodigal who's come back you know we rejoice with you that you came back to him amen how long have you been back with him truly not so long, trying for a while. Jesus loves you. Isn't it wonderful? You know? And, and in these meetings, people are honest. I was talking to Sarah, my daughter, and she said, in church, people don't really want other people to know. But here, you've got a placard saying you're a sex addict, you're, you're this, you're that, you're the other. You know, and it's all out there because you want Jesus to fix you. Someone say, praise God.
that wasn't a normal touch. That was a prophetic touch. God's dealing with something in your gut. Here comes the ex-Anglican. Stephen, I'm in a vision. You are, you know, an autumn leaf is about to fall off the branch and the wind is blowing on it and it's fluttering. That's your life. It's fluttering. It's changing. It's changing. And the time will come and the wind will blow, it, blow you. Your life is changing. So don't try to hang on to the branch. When the wind blows... <laughs> Forget the past because you can't change it. You understand? Yes, yes, I do. Forget the past. Just tonight, when they pray for you, ask for deliverance, okay? You know Jesus has stopped you. Jesus has stopped you. If you want to stop, he'll stop you. You need to take a check, a stop with him. Because not everything's all right in your life. A lot of confusion. The world's pulling you. Friends are pulling you. You're not paying attention to Jesus. So he stopped you tonight in his presence. God loves you with an awesome love, but stop and don't go. keep going in that direction. Follow Jesus. Do you understand what I'm talking about? Yeah. But you need to stop, take a check, and walk a different way because Jesus is waiting for you. That's why I've stopped you. Why have you come? Why have you come in the line? To be a Joseph in this generation. Um, to serve God in the business realm. Um, to create and to help people out as we go forward. So can I talk to you? You first of all have to serve him in the spirit realm. Before you're any good in the business realm. Unless you walk with him, you cannot change the world around you because he is the light of the world. Okay? Yep, absolutely. Amen. Bless you. Move it to the side. Adriel, I see fire all over you. I see fire all over you. Adriel, you're carrying fire. You're carrying fire. You need to be aware of it. Wherever you go, you're carrying fire. Live a sanctified life. You've been a good church man. Faithful, is that right? Yep. Helping in your church? Yep. In the worship team. You're a great encouragement to your pastor? Yep. There's one thing you lack. Um, There's one thing you lack. 
one thing you lack, God's power. There are many people who are faithful in church, but there's one thing they lack. They need the Holy Spirit. Amen. Carla. God sees you. Even when you think he doesn't. I see you. God sees you. With him alone. In the sweetness of his presence. I see you in stillness. In his presence. There's no music. I don't hear any music going on. Is that right? Hmm? Yeah. You're still. You're alone with him. You're in his realm. I honor you. You married a good wife. <laughs> now, do you want me to talk to you or not? The Lord says, stop wasting your money. <laughs> Bless you. So God loves you. Whether you turn to the left or whether you turn to the right, His love is there. Turn to the left, He's there. Turn to the right. You turn around, He's there. You cannot escape His presence. Whatever you're doing, He's there, the God of love. It's heavy here. It's heavy here. Just leave her alone, guys. It's heavy here. Fire! Just leave her, Frank. Now, this is what I was saying. Can you get out of the way, Daniela and Lucy? John, get out of the way. This is what I was saying about the praise dance. When the Holy Spirit would come upon people and they would dance in praise. This is a Holy Spirit praise dance. Come and dance upon people right now in their seats, Lord. Lord, let the spirit of dance come upon people right now, Lord. Let them dance unto the Lord as David danced, Lord. You know, if the children didn't praise the Lord, Jesus said the stones would praise Him. The stones would praise Him. Is there anyone who will praise the Lord? Lord Jesus, give us the spirit of praise. Thank you, Jesus. You know, in the days, the old outpourings of the Holy Spirit, the Holy Spirit would come upon people and they would dance like David danced. 
And they called it the praise break. People would start dancing and praising the Lord. Hallelujah. I feel like we're an old time Pentecostal meeting here. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And the church decided that it wasn't proper. What the Holy Spirit did wasn't proper. And so they decided to have smoke machines. And schedules. But when the Holy Spirit comes, you'll throw your schedule out the window and you'll dance like David danced. You'll get baptized in the Holy Spirit and with fire and broken bones will be healed. Marriages will be restored. Children will come back to Him. MS is being healed. Thank you, Jesus. Some manifestations aren't for catching. They're from God. Just can't stop praising his name. Just can't stop praising his name, Jesus. Oh, the Lord. having a good time tonight who's offended by the Holy Spirit who's offended by the Holy Spirit hallelujah we welcome the Holy Spirit amen we welcome the Holy Spirit we pray we fast that he would come and when he comes we lay out the red carpet for him and give him as much time he just say, Lord, take over. Just take over, Lord. Amen. Take over. Praise God. Someone say, praise the Lord. Lord